Ariana restaurant in Brighton, the owner says she's heartbroken by what's unfolding in Afghanistan. Things were getting so much better and then everything just went like overnight, it's just upside down. And now it's crazy, it's a chaos back home. Mahija Rostami worries about Taliban rule and what it could mean for relatives and friends. Every day we're just so tense, trying to figure out if they're okay, what is going on. We don't know what tomorrow will bring, but we are hopeful. Patty Quigley lost her husband Patrick on 9-11 when his plane crashed into the World Trade Center. Now she's interim executive director of Razia's Ray of Hope Foundation, a group that raises money to educate girls in Afghanistan. We are willing to work with whatever government is in place right now. They've built schools and educated hundreds of girls, work she hopes to continue. If we educate the girls halfway across the world, their effect will have a positive effect. Rostami wishes the U.S. had stayed longer in Afghanistan. I think if the U.S. hang in there a little bit more time. She says it's hard to see the country in chaos. We invested billions of dollars, so many soldiers, lives were lost. Uh, and now all of that, I feel like it was for nothing. Rostami says she is glued to the TV for updates. She is concerned about schools being allowed to remain open and still being able to keep in touch with friends on social media.